it's your girl Grace aka Face Quizzit here and I'm so excited because you know now I'm using my new equipment, my new light, new everything and you can see the difference in the video I hope anyway. Um, they're clearer, they're brighter, the light is correct, it's on point. Yes honeys, I am excited. Now I can do my videos and they'll be of top quality as opposed to me working hard, doing a lot of work and it looking shabby in the video. It really annoys me. Yeah, I said it. I'm only human. It really does annoy me. You know, I put in all the effort. It looks nice under the naked eye. And I'm watching the video, I'm looking at the pictures and I'm thinking, oh God, this is so not nice, you know. But hey, enough of that. I've gone and invested in some good equipment, light and everything, you know, new lens, new this and that. Oh, give us, I'm ready for you, let's go. <laughs> really excited, really, 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 really excited. Without further ado, divas, let's talk about this look that I'm rocking right here. What do you think? You know, I'm a Valentine's Day baby myself. I mean, I was born two days to Valentine's. I was born February 12th. So really and truly, you know, Valentine's Day is my thing. So I wanted to create, I wanted to do a look for you guys that you could rock with your significant other on Valentine's Day. If you go out on a date night, you know, this is the look for you. Something classic, not too much, not, doesn't look like you're trying too much, you know, you can slick your hair back the way I'm rocking it in this um, video. Or, you know, you can do something fabulous with, you know, loose waves and all that kind of, you know, all that kind of jazz, whatever rocks your boat um but you know i just feel like if you're going out with a guy you know especially for those of you who are in a new relationship you know you don't want to look like you try too hard you want to look fabulous you want to look like you woke up like this you know so yeah this is the look for you you know semi-nude eyes if you like um with a hint of a you know smoked out corners um and red lip red is the color of love so you know what, what other color lipstick are we gonna put on if not red lippy, right? Right, right, okay, so red lippy it is. So yeah, this is the look, you know. Don't let your man think you try too hard. Don't overdo it with the highlight and contouring as well, okay? Um, I've already got a um, highlight and contouring video as well as uh, uh, how I do my full foundation routine. I did, you know, whole con that's actually my most popular video with the most views i will be doing another updated one later on in the year but not just yet okay i have uh, other things that i want to do for now but i will do an updated version okay um yeah so don't go overboard divas just you know like i said make it look like you woke up like this don't let the guy think that oh god she's trying so hard for me no i woke up like this i'm a diva i'm fabulous okay honey there we go. All right, divas, without further ado, let's get into this tutorial. So the first thing I'm going to be applying today is Walk of Shame Eyeshadow by Urban Decay Cosmetics. And I'm applying this all over my brow bone and it's going to act as my um, brow highlight color today. Um, I'm applying this using a flat angle shading brush and I'm just applying it all over my brow and I've just tidied up my brow with, um, you know, a brow brush. I saw some hair sticking out. Anyway, next I'm going in with Bok, which is by Urban Decay. Um, I'm taking it from the Naked palette, but I believe they do solos of this particular um, shadow as well. So I'm just applying this into my crease using a blending brush. And this is acting as my first crease color. And I'm just applying it into my crease and taking it upwards. Next, I'm going in with Ground Brown by MAC Cosmetics, uh, and I, um, this is acting as my second crease color. I'm applying this using a flat blending brush, uh, and I'm just applying this into my crease. And this one I'm applying more intensely, because I want a slight cut crease, but not sharp, just very slight cut crease. And I'm just blending that out. Bam, bam, bam. Okay, so I'm going back in with Buck because I feel like I've applied too much of the ground brown and I just want to fade it out a little bit. So I'm going back in with Buck, which I used initially, and I'm applying it on the edges of the um, ground brown 
and I'm just fading it upwards towards my um, brow bone. Now I'm taking Studio Sculpt Concealer in NC35 and I'm applying this all over my lid and I'm just going to use this as my base today um, for my main colour. Just something for the colour to adhere to. And I'm just applying this all over the lid. Now I'm going in with Big Ol Pigment by Ila Masca Cosmetics and I'm applying this all over my lid using a flat shading brush. Just back now. Next, I'm going in with this dark brown eyeshadow. I'm afraid, Divas, I do not remember what this is called. I thought it was Espresso by MAC because this is my MAC eyeshadow palette, but I do have a couple of NYX co um, colors in there, about three, and I have a feeling this one is actually one of NYX eyeshadows, but unfortunately, I can't remember the name of it, Divas. Any brown eyeshadow would do. I do apologize. So I've used that to fade out the, um, you know, the outer V. Now I'm going in with Blackout by Urban Decay to intensify that outer V a little bit more. And I'm applying this using a pencil brush. Going back in with the blending brush, I'm just fading out, um, you know, that dark, the dark colors in my outer V, just to make it a bit smoother, the transition a bit smoother. I didn't particularly like the look I was getting with Big Gold. It wasn't what I was going for. So I decided to go back in with um, All Pigment, which is also by Ila Masca. And I'm applying this on top of the Big Gold. Um, I will be doing a separate tutorial using just this all pigment so that you can really see the beauty of it. It's an absolutely gorgeous color and it just catches the light. But um, yeah, we'll do that next time. Now I'm just lining my lids with um, a black liquid uh, eyeliner. This one is um, Super Liner by L'Oreal Paris in Black Le Croix. But any black um, liquid liner would do to be quite honest. And this is going to act as the base for my lashes. Now I'm lining my waterline using uh, a black hole pencil. Again, this one is Perversion by Urban Decay, but you know, any black uh, hole pencil would do. I'm lining both my um, lower and upper wa um, waterline. And I'm just applying a couple of coats of, of mascara onto my lashes in readiness for my false lashes and they are in form of these gorgeous mink lashes which I'm going to be applying and voila I've applied it off camera and this is it hope you like it so now we're going to move on to the lip stevers so first thing I'm taking is this current lip liner by MAC Cosmetics and I'm just using this to outline my lips. Just following the natural line of my lips, or the natural outline of my lips, whatever you want to call it. You get the gist. The gist. Yeah, just, you know, drawing around that lip line. Just making it a bit more pronounced, you know. There we go. Now I'm fading it out with a blending a lip blending brush just to avoid any harsh lines and now I'm going to go in with Victoriana lipstick which is a limited edition lipstick by MAC Cosmetics I absolutely love this red um, it's matte but it's non-drying unlike Ruby Woo as much as I love Ruby Woo I just find it a bit too dry so yeah I have to say this is my favorite red lippy now Divas, and it only comes out on special occasions. And I'm applying this all over my lips. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. It is Valentine's Day after all, isn't it? And there you have it, my lovely divas. What say ye? 
I love this lip, red lippy. I really, really do. And I think it goes really, really well with this um, eyeshadow look. have it divas this is the final look i hope you like it i hope you've enjoyed this tutorial as much as i've enjoyed creating it if you have please go ahead and give it a thumbs up and also remember to subscribe to this channel please very important just click on that subscribe button you know it's free <laughs> subscribe please um subscribing to this channel simply means that you get instant notification of all my videos as and when i release them so please go ahead and give it um, click that subscribe button. Also, please go ahead and share share this video on your all your social media platforms Facebook Twitter um, LinkedIn Pinterest Google Plus, you know wherever you can share it go ahead and share it help a sister out You know, there ain't no shame in my game. I'm gonna ask you please go ahead and share it If you don't ask you don't get don't ask it nicely. I really do appreciate you divas Yeah, so thank you so much. Also, if you have any um, you know comments that you want to leave, um, go ahead and leave it in the description box and I'll try as much as possible to respond or if there's any looks you want me to create, go ahead, leave it in the description box below and I will endeavour to create it. Before you do ask me to create something however, please have a look at my old videos because a lot of them I've already done. Like people are asking me to do a full face um, you know foundation routine blah, blah blah i've done that i did it a while back you know so go ahead and have a look at it foundation how i do my foundation highlight and contouring and they also ask about uh how i do my brows i've done that as well so just go and check out my old videos you know and um if there's something if there's something that isn't there that you want me to do that i haven't already done then please put it in the description box below and i will endeavor to you know create it but anyway divas enough of my gibberish go out go and have fun on valentine's day go and dazzle your significant other you know with this fabulous look um not too much just simple something classic for valentine's day and as we all know red is the color of love so you know we have to have a little red lippy there you know what i mean so yeah divas go ahead and have fun and until next time do stay absolutely fabulous i love you loads mwah, 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 mwah. love you my divas have fun ciao bye